Hey guys, Sonia here. I have another Dollar Tree haul for you guys, and I know what you guys are thinking. You guys are probably like, holy crap, this girl is just crazy addicted because she just uploaded a Dollar Tree video yesterday, and you're right, I did. But I was unexpectedly running around today. I totally forgot that I had an appointment uh, for Jackson this morning, and so I had to call my husband to come home pick me up. I had to take him back to work and then take Jackson and myself to the appointment. And then I figured since I was um, already out and about, I had to stop at Target and pick up some toilet paper and some razor refills and stuff like that. And it's right next to Dollar Tree. So hello. I just said, what the heck? I'm just going to stop in. And I'm really glad I did because I found something that I've been waiting and waiting for my Dollar Trees to get and um, all you Florida Dollar Treeers out there you guys all know what I'm talking about we get everything late everybody hauls stuff and then like a month or two later then we finally get it in our stores that's the case with me most of the time there's sometimes where I get things kind of around the same time that I see people starting to haul but for the most part we get gypped and we have to wait a long time so yes, there is one special thing that I'm like super excited about and um, but that's going to be last. So I'm going to go ahead and do food. I will do Louie's dog food first. You guys know I always get these. I picked up four cans, two, dollar, or, um, two for a dollar. That's a really great deal. Sorry, I felt like it, I wiped it down a little bit. I felt like it was a little bit fuzzy. So if it was, I apologize for that. Um, okay, and then I picked up this big old thing of smart water um, because I was going to drink it. I was super thirsty when I was there. And then um, we got in the car. It was, you know, in the bags and stuff. I couldn't even reach it. So I just came home and drank some nice cold water when I got here. So I'm just going to throw this in the fridge. And then for next time I'm running around, I'll just grab it for Jackson and I. Um, I grabbed Jackson more Wales crackers because for some reason the other last week when I was at several Dollar Trees, I didn't pick up any of the Wales crackers. And Jackson's been out. He's been asking for crackers, and I felt terrible because I forgot them. So I picked him up a couple boxes. I picked up more of the Forelli hazelnut spread. I did try this, and it is really good. I've never tried the Nutella brand, so I can't compare. But tuna, tuna? I'm so sorry, Tina at Frugal Fun and Fabulous. <laughs> That's so embarrassing. Um, she's she like loves Nutella, and she says that this is tastes exactly the same. So I'm trusting her that this is like super. I mean, I think it tastes really super good, but I'm going by what she said as far as that this is very comparable to the Nutella. Um, but I made a recipe of hers, and it's the. Uh, Nutella brownies those turned out super good by the way I, um, I think you guys should definitely go check out her channel if you're not subscribed to her um, her channel name is frugal fun and fabulous and um, she does all these Dollar Tree gourmet videos and it's it's just awesome but anyways I have another recipe in mind for these and it is a um, s'mores pizza like a grilled s'mores pizza it sounds so fabulous but yeah that's why I picked these up Sorry, I went into like a whole huge explanation about that. And then I picked up these fruit patch strawberry apple sauces. They're made in the USA. That's always a big plus for me. And the reason I got these, I never buy applesauce from Dollar Tree because um, for some reason unknown to me, they use high fructose corn syrup in it, which, I mean, applesauce, I don't really feel like it needs it to even be sweetened. But um, a lot of times they do sweeten it, and they sweeten it with artificial sweeteners, which I'm just, I'm not cool with. So, um, or high fructose corn syrup. But this one has just apples, sugar, water, strawberry puree, ascorbic acid, and that's pretty much it, malic acid. So, yeah, um, I picked this up for Jackson. Sometimes he loves applesauce, sometimes he doesn't. He just gets in these moods. But these are great to send with Shane, and hopefully if I get the job that I'm interviewing for tomorrow, these will be great for me to take um, for lunch and for a snack and stuff. So that is it for food. I'm going to move this stuff out of the way. 
Um, I picked up this Bubble Yum chapstick and Jackson saw it and he is obsessed with chapstick now because he sees me applying my lip balm all the time and he always wants some so I let him wear some and so he's seen this and he wanted it so I gave it to him but I had no intentions of buying it. I was just going to put it back but I forgot to take it out and I ended up paying for it. So this is just going to get given to uh, my niece Millie in her little gift bag. Just picked up some cotton balls. I was completely out and... I had a manicure yesterday and my nails are already chipping. It's just, I don't know. I don't know what to do. I tried the gel nails and oh my God, I had the worst experience. The girl did not know what she was doing. And when I went yesterday to have them taken off, he said that was the worst job he had ever seen. It took him over an hour to get the gel off my nails. He eventually just had to sand it all off. Because the girl who did my nails had no idea what she was doing and they looked terrible. So I just had him give me just like a manicure and paint my nails. But they're already starting to chip and so I'm, I'm going to have to just repaint my nails tomorrow before my interview. So I had to make sure I had some cotton balls. Um, I picked up some 8 pack of tissue packs because I really needed these yesterday. Shane and I were out, you know, running errands and stuff and his sinuses were acting up terribly or his allergies or something and he was constantly blowing his nose and asking me for tissues and all I had was napkins that I grabbed from the car. So, yeah, I'm definitely going to have to have a pack of these in my purse, a pack of these in the car and just some on hand because his allergies just like out of nowhere can just start acting up. So, um, oh yeah, I picked up some nail polish remover because I'm, I think I'm completely out of that as well. Okay, so I finally picked up the Lemon Verbena and I thought that this was hand soap, but it's not. It's bath and shower gel, guys. I don't know if, um, if anybody's noticed that. Um, most people I see hauling them, I think they say that they're hand, hand soaps. And I mean, I, it looks like a hand soap, but it does say bath and shower gel, which I was even more excited about because the reason I picked these up and I haven't been hauling them previously, I have seen these in my Dollar Tree. They've been there for at least a month now, um, but I haven't picked them up because I've seen people hauling the wipes that are the NOLA brand and they match this little picture here. And um, I still, I had not had those in my Dollar Tree and so I was not going to pick these up unless I got ended up getting the wipes in because um, I had a gift idea. Well today they finally got the wipes in. I'm super excited. They had the lemon verbena and the aloe vera and the honey and aloe vera. These are the anti-aging and then these are just the moisturizing facial cleansing wipes. And I literally grabbed like six of each of these. And the reason why is because um, I feel like just this and this together, I think that this would just be an awesome like Christmas gift or um, just an impromptu gift. I don't know. I've had this idea in my head for a while and that's the only reason why I hadn't picked these guys up was because I was waiting for these and the fact that this ends up being a bath and shower gel is just a super plus because um, I don't know hand soap is I don't know hand soap everybody that comes to your house would be using it and I don't know I feel like it would last longer and be more of a personal gift the fact that it's a sh bath a shower gel so anyway yeah, for two bucks. This is a great, great gift idea, you guys. And so that's why I stocked up. I grabbed two of the lemon verbena of the shower gels, and then I grabbed two of the honey almond. I'm not crazy about the honey almond smell, but it's not too bad. But I definitely like the lemon better. Um, but yeah, I mean, I don't know. I just think that's a super cute gift and just... I don't know. So yeah, I'm excited about these. So I definitely picked up picked up a lot of these guys. I think I picked up six of each, but there's going to be uh, you know some for myself, some that I'm going to be giving away, um, you know, to 
certain loved ones and all of that and then some that I'm just going to have put aside as gifts for just, you know, in case I get invited to, a, a, you know, a Christmas party or something and I want to give the host or the hostess, you know, a gift as I go, that would, I mean, I just feel like this is, this is perfect for that. So yeah, I definitely picked up a ton of those and there's 32 a pack. I haven't used them yet. I'll let you guys know how they work. And if you guys have tried them, please comment below and let me know. Okay, and then the last thing I picked up was this little, like, it's kind of like a locker tub tote or whatever. And um, I picked this up because I have several of these in different colors. I have the green and the red and the blue. And I, Jackson broke one of the blue ones. He used, he flips them over and uses them as step stools and he jumps on them and all stuff and he broke it. Luckily he did not get hurt. But um, I picked this one up for him and then I got home and I was like, this is teal. This is turquoise. It's not even like the blue blue. But that's okay. I'm still going to use it for in his room. So you guys will see me using those in his um, room tour, which I'm going to be starting um, not tomorrow because I have my interview but probably on Wednesday, I'll get started on his room tour. And it's going to be step for step. But, um, yeah, I'll get more back to you guys on that. That's it for the Dollar Tree haul. Um, I do have a Dollar Tree product review. And I think I'm just going to go ahead and add it onto here because this is only going on 12 minutes. So I'm just going to go ahead and do um, a Dollar Tree product review, which I have three items that I'm going to review for you guys. So if you guys want to see that, please stay tuned. Okay, guys, um, I decided I'm just going to go ahead and do the Dollar Tree product review as a separate video because my lunch is done. So I'm just going to um, hurry up and eat that before it gets cold, and then I will record the um, Dollar Tree product review video. So if you guys want to see that, be on the lookout for it. And I hope you guys like this small impromptu Dollar Tree haul. If you did, please like or thumbs up and, um, subscribe if you guys aren't subscribed and yeah. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.